Wow, yeah, yeah, good, good that's a mage deal. It's a mage deal. <laughs> she's, she's working it in there, isn't she? I'm how, trying. Like, how see how many, see see how many major funds you can, you can pack into this interview. It's Max Major, and this is episode 50 of the vlog. I have a lot of reasons to be excited today. That is one of them. We are sold out for the complete run of Think Again here in New York. And right now I'm about to go into the studio to do a radio interview and read some minds on air. It's 99.5 The River with Kevin and Shanna and happy Friday weekend just about here. And we have got a guest in studio. Uh, we like magicians around here. We apparently. do. Mm -hmm. uh, today we have uh, Ma uh, Max Major joining us who is magician and mentalist. Yes. He's Max, a major big you? deal. I'm doing good. It's great to have you on the I show. See what you did there, major big deal. Yeah, he's ah, also see? major. I'm doing great. Yeah. Sure. Well, let's uh, let's see. Can we try what, something? Yes. I would love to try something. I want you to pull a memory into mind right now. Got it. Okay. Okay. And in that memory, you'll have a person, a place, and a thing. Right now, hone in on one of those three. Okay. Okay. You're not thinking of the person. You're thinking of the events of the day right now. Yes. Yes, I am. Yes. 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 Okay. Well, that was a one in three shot. That was a one in three, 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 three shot. Three. Right. Right. But think specifically about the events of that day. Now, you're kind of closing your eyes. So you're pulling. Yeah. That means you're really pulling this back in. It means you were very young. Yeah, I was. You were very Absolutely, young. Absolutely, I was young. And this was an event related to your your birthday. You were... Think about who was involved in this. Obviously, family was involved if it's your birthday. I can guess that much. But think specifically right now, you're thinking about... Uh, you huge smile just came across your face. If you guys were in this room, you would see lit up when I said you're thinking about a person. It's your mother, because that's that's that really strong connection we all have with our mother. Absolutely. But think about more specifically in detail about this memory, what you guys were doing. Okay. Uh, and be honest, you're not just agreeing with me right now to make me look good. Oh, no, I would. Really I, I right don't now. want okay. that to happen. I want okay. it to be as real as possible. Yes. Yeah, so at me. far, you're, you're okay. Think about exactly. <laughs> <laughs> there's a, there's a sense of, uh, of of travel or movement as well in this memory I'm getting because you kind of you're kind of shifting around a lot. Yeah. Um, are you thinking about a time near your sixth or seventh birthday with your mother when she took you on like a like a surprise trip or something to to I, I don't know like an like an amusement park or something like that? Is that what? I, exactly right. Yeah. Think about the place, the specific, the actual uh, amusement okay. park itself. Yeah. And you just spell the name of this place in your head. Took a while. It's a two-parter. I saw you nodding. Look at me. Was it Great Escapes? This is the... Yes. Oh. And it's... I'm not on the air. <laughs> oh Unbelievable. Wow. That is... Wow. That is mind-blowing. Yeah. Wow. Cool. Now, Shanna, you obviously have to have a turn, don't yes. you? Yes. Yes. Yeah. So this is going to be a little more personal to you, um, not because we're accessing your memory, but we're going to try to access your phone. Okay. Oh, yeah. oh boy. This makes people really <laughs> uncomfortable. Can I actually borrow your phone? Yes. Yeah. Do you have a password on your phone? I do. Um, so uh, you, this is your keypad where yep. you put in your password. Imagine yourself typing in your numbers, but don't like look where the numbers go because then I'll just follow your eyes. See across the top here where the numbers show up? Boom, yeah. boom, boom, boom. Imagine there as I'm tapping, just imagine the numbers of your password appearing one at a time. So watch right here. Okay. One, two, three, four. One more time. Imagine your numbers across the top of the screen. Okay. Right here. That's the first one. Okay. Second one. Okay. Oh, you think you're so cute. All the digits are the same. <laughs> oh, man. It's my passcode! He did it. He did the passcode. He just did Shanna's. Yeah, you mean you watched me type it. So. Yes! Is... Oh, my gosh. That was crazy. Wow. Dude, that was awesome. That's great. Ladies and gentlemen, his name is Max Major. Nailed it. One of the best interviews I've ever done. That had to sound amazing on radio. I've got to get back to the theater. We have sold out all four nights of Think Again. We have added a Friday matinee. I have a show to do tonight, a matinee tomorrow at two, and another show Friday, and I am fired up. So Max unlocked my phone. I have no idea how he knew the numbers. He just told me to look at it. I don't know if there were sixes in my eyeballs or what, but dude's a genius. So Max asked me to think of a, a positive childhood memory and uh, I immediately went to one that I like to share with people because uh, it has to do with uh, amusement parks and that's always been my favorite thing and I hadn't known Max more than two minutes before we did this and he said it was your mom she surprised you with a trip to Great Escapes. The only thing you got wrong Max it's Great Escape. 
All right, great escape, not great escape, so nice try.